Hi everyone, it's Victoria Ontiveros, Marketing Coordinator here at the ISO 9001 Group, helping organizations improve their operations and reduce their risk. And as you can see, um, my setup here today for this episode of ISO Wake Up Call is just a little bit different. Um, I do still have my mug, but in an effort to prevent the spread of COVID-19, I am currently working from home remotely for the ISO 9001 Group. Now, for those of you who have also found yourselves working remotely, I thought it'd be helpful to share some tips on how you can stay successful while working from home. Because ultimately, no matter where we work from, our teams are still relying on us to still deliver the same consistency and quality in our work. And our customers are still relying on us to provide the same level of customer service. So hopefully these tips will help you in staying successful while working remotely. The first tip I want to share is to stick to your schedule. If your normal work hours are from eight to five, I encourage you to log into your online environment and maintain those same working hours. Um, I know it can be difficult maybe to separate your personal um, activities from your work activities, especially when you're working in your own personal space, but you just have to have that level of discipline to still maintain your normal working hours and your normal working schedule. Now, when I talk about sticking to your schedule, that could also mean taking the time to actually get ready as if you were going to work. Um, we might be really tempted to put on our sweatpants, put on a t-shirt and get work done that way. And for some of you that may work, um, but I have found personally for myself, I am much more productive if I stick to my normal routine, my normal schedule and get ready as if I was going into the office. So sticking to your schedule can help you with um, staying successful from your home office. Now my second tip I want to share is to set up an environment for success. What does that look like? An environment that can help you be successful could be a designated home office. Maybe you have that space in your home. It could also be a desk, um, just a quiet, clean space, free of distraction where you are able to focus on your work activities, right? So just making sure you have all the equipment you need, whether it's a laptop, a headset for calls, um, any other equipment you would need to kind of replicate the same environment as if you were in office. That's going to help you um, stay successful. Another important piece we can often forget when we talk about setting up an environment is a secure setup. So when you're working from home, you might be pulling up work documents, company documents, um, client information. All of that is secured information, it's confidential information. That can be put at risk if you are currently not working on a secure internet connection. Right, so ensuring you're only connected to a trusted, your home Wi-Fi and making sure that's secure. That information could also be at risk if the device you're using, whether it's a computer, a laptop, is not currently installed with an antivirus software. So using an antivirus software on any devices you're using to work is going to help you protect your company information, your client's information, and even your own information from being a target for information security and cyber attacks, something we might not think about. So setting up an environment for success. The last tip I want to share is to stay engaged, stay connected with your team. When we're working in a setting where it's just us, it might be easy for us to put ourselves in a bubble and to kind of feel isolated, to just focus, um, narrow our focus on just our activities. And we might lose that connection that we have in office. Maybe you're used to going into your coworker's office and just asking a simple question. And just because we're working remotely doesn't mean we should lose that same ability to communicate. So I encourage you to take advantage of maybe video conferencing software or emails or chat applications that can help you stay connected and keep the lines of communication open with your teammates and with your colleagues during normal work hours. That is very important in maintaining your company culture 
and just keeping everyone engaged throughout the workday. So the three tips again are to stick to your schedule, set up an environment for success, and stay engaged and connected with your team. So hopefully you found this video helpful if you're looking for tips on how to stay successful while working remotely. If you did, I would really appreciate if you liked and shared this video with someone else who could benefit. And if you have any other suggestions or any other tips to help everyone that's working from home uh, stay successful, please comment down below. I'm Victoria Ontiveros, Marketing Coordinator here at the ISO 9001 Group, helping organizations improve operations and reduce risk.